Hello YouTube, welcome back to dot 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 what question mark the game. Picking up where we left off. I was going to go back into the... Is this the hotel hotel or the police station? I genuinely don't know. Either way, we can't go in there if we want to travel with our friends here to the murder scene. Agent Morgan, if I could just give you a friendly warning. Are you really upset about me taking over the case? <clears throat> I have the authority approved by the FBI to assume command. I understand you don't like it, but you will follow my orders. I'm not disputing FBI authority, but this is our town. You won't get far alone, and you gain nothing by antagonizing me. It's part of my personality. I just do things my way. I can take you off the case if you wish. Stop it, you two. We need to solve this case. Yes, not need again. Among ourselves. Mm. <laughs> what was that smile? Uh oh, I've got to try and remember what third person view is. Oh, I found it. Why is the car vibrating? Okay, I'm remembering the buttons. Kinda. Oh, we're at the hospital. That's what we're doing. Now, where's Accelerate? Ah, uh, there's Accelerate. It's perfectly fine. Everything makes perfect sense. No, wait. I meant the opposite of what I just said. Ow. Anna's body was discovered I'll be dead after they finished talking. Green, along with his two grandchildren, Isaac and Isaiah. What were they doing in the forest? Just their daily routine. They found Anna's body during a morning walk. So you've talked to them already? Not officially. Not yet. What does not officially mean? Are you out of your mind? You haven't interviewed them yet? Agent 6,000 yards? appropriate. We were given orders to wait for you to arrive. Orders by who? A man called Abrams from the FBI. Robert, is it? Good old Bob Abrams. I did tell him to stay out of it. It's always tough to have a meddling boss, huh, Zach? I thought you knew, Agent Morgan. Don't worry about it. We may not have taken official statements, but we got all the information we need. I can oh feel God, you in right steering, now. It's so bad. Thanks, George, but that won't be necessary. I want to hear the details from the witnesses themselves, firsthand. I just can't believe that the children had to witness the crime scene. They may be traumatized. You'd better do this carefully. Don't tell me you get nervous talking to children, Emily. Not at all. That's that's not what I meant. Then what did you mean? Ugh, just forget it. What did you mean, Emily? Thank you, Frog Lawyer. Uh, I can't really look at the chat and steer correctly because this car does not steer correctly. For a 30 month streak with a tier 1 sub. It's nearly been two years now, right? No, it's almost been one, but you're close. Keep up the great work. Thank you. Oh, you're right. We did almost break 50 miles per hour. I'm going to have to check the map because I'm not convinced this road is leading where I need it to be. I, I need the map, please. Yeah. And then I need... No, 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 no. Come back. Is this as far out as it'll go? It is. Good God. Okay, if we follow this road... Uh, hmm. It's all the way over here. Are you shitting me? Jesus. So we need to get on this road. Which is from here. Um. This is a bridge. A tunnel, I should say. Are we down here? Oh, we are. Okay, go all the way, go across a bridge, keep on going, keep on going. And then I'll check again once we get to, like, here-ish. Jesus. Oh no, I lost all momentum because I held the wrong button. We might not actually have enough fuel to make it that far. The fuel seems to drain very, very quickly. Now here's the bridge. And I believe it was like the second left. Not only fuel, but the car does have a health bar. And it goes down by quite a bit if I hit anything. Get out of my way. Beep beep, I'm a police officer. I'm not, no actually, I'm an FBI agent. That's one above police officer. It means I get to do one free crime. Only one though. Be taking the 
corners tighter. It'll save more fuel that way. Oh, wait, we have a talk. Agent Morgan. Oh, never mind. No, we don't. want to keep talking. Maybe we should cut the chit chat and go get our official statements. George is right. Let's head over to the forest. Don't give park. me a talk prompt if the talk prompt is just shut up and get to the next objective. It's just weird. Oh, so I saw people ask. I don't have any specific plan. I already went over this, but that was right at the start. Oh god, I spun out. Might just be this tonight. Uh, I don't know what else, honestly. I do have an indie game I want to try this week, but I'm not allowed to show it on stream until the embargo lifts, which is the 11th. Now then... Now then, now then. So we take a right onto this road. The map, wait, the map turns with the direction your car is facing. Oh god, that just makes it like four times more confusing. Okay, take the next right, get onto the big road. And then I think I want this road here. Jesus, there's no way I have enough fuel to get up here. Like, 100% definitely do not. Oh wait, no, it's not that road. Okay, hang on. There might be a shorter route. I need this turn off here. And I'm down here? Wait, who is this? That's people. Okay. I've totally lost where I am on this map. Oh, there I am. Okay. All the way. All the way. Pardon me. I had a late dinner. <laughs> cool channel change. That was not the right button. Oh god, the frame rate. I'm just gonna run out of fuel with NPCs in the car. This car gets 0 0.002 miles to the gallon. That's generous. Extra long... I got $18 for extra long distance. Bet you wish you got $18 for extra long distance chat. That red tree is very garish compared to everything else. I bet it has a purpose later. Alright, this is probably the right time. We're halfway there. 42% fuel left. Do I have enough to get myself there now that I know for a fact I'm on the right road? Place your bets. I'll try... Oh god. I shouldn't try and cut corners because honestly it just makes you steer like a madman. Thank you, Archrin, for 37 months with a tier 1 sub. Thanks for the entertainment, bet no. Okay, I understand. Driving like this definitely does not help, but all I did there was very slightly press right. You're boned, but you did the wrong year. We're going to be close enough that if I do run out of fuel, we can walk it. I don't know whether the NPCs will accept that, but it's cardio. I think I need to take this right path, but I just want to double check. Yes, I do. I think I'm going to have just enough, personally. Thirty-one. Yeah, we're gonna have enough. We are. If you bet no, I think you're wrong. No, we didn't start at hundred percent fuel. I think we started at like sixty something because it's the same car we were using last time. Oh god, we're going uphill and we're we're getting twenty-five miles per hour max. 
500 yards, 28%. Milk your solid theme intensifies. Urge to whistle intensifies more. Agent Morgan, how much longer do you want to keep talking? I just Wouldn't like hearing your voice, George. Go get our official statements. George is right. Quiet, Let's whatever your name is. Park. Do I have enough to get back? Hell no. 100% absolute zero chance. Literally zero. Oh, did anyone who ordered anything else in the... Also made it. In the night models sale, have you had your stuff dispatched yet? 22% left. Hell yeah. You whistle, you die. I'll take those odds. Oh good, it's the overly loud main menu music. Is this government land? No, it's private. Sorry, you need to speak up, I can't hear you over the menu music. Oh, it stopped. That's right. I'm sure I mentioned that he owns pretty much the whole town. He used the money left by his father to buy up most of the town. Many town residents live on his land. Zach, did you hear that? This entire park. A rich man's personal playground. These country rich folk are amazing. It all looks very well kept, too. Okay. Who's he talking to? The player. Zach is the player. I'm FBI Special Agent Francis York Morgan. Please call me York. It's what everyone calls me. And you are Jim Green? That I am, son. I keep these woods. He, he manages a park and his well, surname is Green. Fine job. Well, I used to be and he used to be a tree surgeon. And these two discovered the body. Yes, my grandchildren, Isaac and Isaiah. Don't head out, you coward. Absorb the game. Zach, you see that? Twins. Just like in my dream. We gotta keep an eye on these two. I'm sorry. Could we talk away from the boys? I want to help your investigation, but I don't want them to hear this. Hello, Robin. Very well. Emily, please. I'll just take them over there then. Thank you. Hold on. Don't do anything without asking me. These children were the first to witness the crime scene. I want to talk to them. Come on. They're just kids. They have no idea what really happened to Anna. That doesn't matter. You agree with me, right, Zach? How heartless. Do you ever think of other people's feelings, ever? One of them is cold, right. Isaac, yes. That's stone cold. Even for the sake of investigation, children see things in pure, simple terms. They may have seen something we adults would never spot, and they are here at our request as well. We could at least chat with them and see if they want to make a statement. Are you serious? I never joke about matters like this. <laughs> oh my god. Don't worry. They aren't as fragile as you think. Look at them. Standing so upright there. Ah. Uh. Now then, Isaac, Isaiah, tell me, what did you find here? Anna, she was so pretty. She had a red dress on. Her hair was shiny. Bright gold hair. There were lots of animals around her. Squirrel, weasel, and a snake. A real snake! We didn't know until then. But we know now. Anna was the fairy of the forest. She was a goddess. She smiled when she Who saw us. Who taught you these words? She looked so happy. That's right, Isaac. Isaiah, she was a fairy. A goddess. I'm sure she is playing with those animals even now. Of course she is. Yeah, of course. Most useful information, boys. Well, Emily, you can take them now. Those kids are going to kill people? Possibly. Okay, Zach. This is where Anna's body was. 
And that means our unsub. Our unknown subject was here too. So, what happened here? Profiling start. Scene missing. There's a lot of scenes missing. Zach, something is still missing. We need more clues. This game is a fever dream we're all having together? Yes. Yes, it is. Happy Halloween also. Oh, I guess it's going to start raining because I've got my poncho on. I guess we should start with the tree. Observe. Two bent pieces of grass. One of four. We need to do that after everyone. Fast forward this after we've seen the new bits. Oh, okay. Picture of vest with holes. Crap, jeez. Uh, there's a bone on the map? I think I hear yellow for a nine month streak with a tier one sub, that's Twitch baby time. I feel I like I need to be high to understand this. You don't have to be, but it helps. Also, our Twitch baby name will be Drugs. Oh, that's the sneaky one. Keeping my extra agent's honor. This is not where the bone was. Oh. But there's a bird's nest with a red dealie. It made the noise, it did a, it did a thing. Uh, how the hell did it land here? Chipped with rust metal dust. Rusted metal dust. My friends, my precious antique friends. Just for that, we're sitting through another profiling. <laughs> before I find the final clue. And nah. Uh, <laughs> crap, jeez. I don't know why that voice line amuses me so much, but it does. Wait, this is where the bone is, apparently. And, like, it's over that side somewhere. Huh. <laughs> Can of pickles? Hell yeah, look at that frame rate. It's one frame for every pickle. Or something else? You got kind of pickles. 
Okay, there's two cans pickles. I think it's another case of an item respawn, because the pickles came back. We've seen this before. Okay, that's not. I need to go to sleep. Church, you seen anything? As you requested, we have permission to stay and look around as needed. But what are you planning on doing? To examine the scene, of course. Basic Crime Investigation 101. We might uncover some further evidence. My men have covered this already. I seriously doubt that there is anything else to find. Well, then you and Emily can wait in the car if that's the case. But I'll take my time here. Okay, we're looking for more red glow. Oh, wait, there's another bird's nest. Oh, it's a collectible of Anna. She's dead now. I wonder if it's that bone on the map. I'm not seeing any other red. Hmm. Anagram, anagram. Oh no, I better not actually be a thing. Anything else up here I missed? I don't think so. Um, Chad, have you seen something that I've missed? Anything that's glowing red besides the giant red tree, I mean? There's another clue here somewhere. Alright, besides the unlimited pickles, yes. Oh, I've got too many pickles in my inventory. I've reached maximum pickle. Oh, oh, I see it, I see it. Another bird's nest. Missing piece of pinheel shoe. What? I have many questions about this. Can you shoot George? Only if he gives me a reason to. Upside down. I guess this is meant to be an anti peace sentiment then. These holes on the ground were made by uh, high stiletto heels all around here. And this depression here, Agent Morgan, I see what happened here. You certainly have a vivid imagination. An interesting theory. Don't you think, Zack? Well, what was his name again? That Hollywood producer. Quentin Tarantino? Right. Joel. Oh, never mind. We really ought to introduce George to him, Zack. Profiling is a little different from writing a screenplay, though. An idea being interesting doesn't make it fact. Let me enlighten you, George. The footprints reveal that George looks like the alien version of Norman Reedus. And 
they're different from Anna's shoes that we saw at the office. Furthermore, there would be even more disgusting evidence if he did kneel and, well, do as you suggest. Masturbation. If you want proof, go ahead and try it for yourself. He knelt here for our reason. to make Flick whistle on the moats. Don't have enough room for new moats, and never will probably. Zach, what was he doing in front of Anna? Jack in it. Play the song again, it will fit here. The game doesn't need any help putting inappropriate music in. Now I get it. He was kneeling to pray in front of her. Just like the twins said. She was a goddess. The unknown self, our unknown subject, offered prayers to one his body. It's been now time massive body mode. Once dead Anna was transformed from an object of despite into Could you speak up a little bit, York? So, is Miss Stiletto Heels? The steps are close, coming up to the body, and then... Why does he want to unsub? Oh, because I didn't like Sekiro. There was a reason to hurry away, then. That settles it, then, George. Miss Stiletto Heels is a third party here. She's not the murderer. No one runs away from an object of worship. She could be another victim who was with Anna. Or perhaps an accomplice who fled for some reason. She is also one who took whatever it was Anna was holding on to in her hand. But why? Why did she leave her here? Yeah, you'll have to speak Only up, I'm wearing a towel. The heels knows the reason for that. She might know something about the man with the reversed peace mark, too. How many women wear high stiletto heels in this town, do you think? Oh, I should think most of them have at least one pair. I do, too, before you ask. But nobody would come all the way out here wearing them, except, well, except maybe one person. Don't keep me in the dark, then. Who might this elegant lady be? Diane. Why is she holding... The, of the art gallery. But she's out of town for a big art okay. auction. I heard she'll be coming back in a couple days. Then we'll just have to give her a warm welcome home. Oh, the Switch was trying to kill itself again. Better, then. Where in town can you find something like this? It should be a building that isn't used anymore. With either a lot of metal or metal machinery or something like that. The old lumber mill. <laughs> it's time to really get this show on the road. Could you guide me to this perfect setting for extravagant murder? Wait, you thought I was doing it? Doing what? Hello, Echo. You thought I was playing that music? No, 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 no. That is the game playing it. I played it during when we were sitting on the title screen. Also, the whistling is part of the music as well, yes. Although I can whistle. But it sets Sora off. Oh, it's back again. Pretty far from here. If that's where she was killed, why would the killer go to all the trouble of carrying her all the way here? I don't know yet. I can't whistle along with it because My it's got a delay on the switch of like a second, so it'd be even worse. The unsub's personality is totally different before and after the crime. I can the whistle to when I play it during the ad break, if we have to. And then displays powerful adoration after she's dead. Something close to love that could well be the key to all this. I will say this, is this though, the George, car that has no petrol left? Filing is a risky business. Of course, if the unsub planted those stiletto footprints himself, well then, 
Everything I've just said falls apart. But there's no evidence that he left those stiletto footprints. I'm sure we have Miss Stiletto Heels to thank for those tracks. All I can do is deduce the unsub's feelings in light of the evidence. And carefully figure the unsub's M.O. Modus operandi, his way of thinking. It usually unveils something that a normal forensic analysis may overlook. That's my way of profiling. It's not for everyone, but it works for me. What? Oh, it's playing dramatic music. Also, we have unlimited fuel, I think. Oh, hell yeah. I don't know why we're feeling so dramatic right now, really, but whatever, I'll take the unlimited fuel. Unlimited health as well. I first joined the force, this lumber mill was still in full swing. It closed up right when I first moved here. And now it's totally 80 miles an hour, we've done it. I presume so. Eight more and we I'm can travel through time. Inside, so I don't know for sure, oh god. Oh god. Sure uh, deserted buildings are perfect for criminal hideouts and activities. I keep telling Harry to have the place torn down. Probably. After all, it's already been used as the site of Anna's murder. You don't know that for sure yet, Agent Morgan. That's right. But the perpetrator selected the lumber. Agent York, you seem very confident about this. Confident? No. Confidence is a sweet spot for being rude and hopeless. I'm just drawing natural conclusions from the facts that we've seen. That sounds exactly like being full of confidence. Sick drift, and thank you. Normal people with common sense. Common sense can be the opposite of facts sometimes. Ah, and then I ruined it. Oh, I will, Agent York. Thank you for another pearl of wisdom. Either way, we'll know for sure by simply going to the lumber mill. So keep your pearls of wisdom to yourself, and let's hurry. Well said, George. Shut can up, you George. Step on it, Agent York. Shut up, Emily. Better check this actually leads to the damn thing. Yep. Okay. <laughs> You've never taken off any sweet jumps, obviously. What's that? Wait. What is that? I'm not allowed to get out of the car. It's like a key symbol, right? I'll have to try and remember that, sir. It's too dramatic, intense a moment to be allowed outside of the car, outside of my location that I'm heading towards. It's fine, we'll get on the way back. I don't think you get to fast travel in this, so we'll have to go the long way anyway. It's pretty easy to remember where it is on the way to the lumber yards, on the side with the water. It's a magnifying glass. Oh, see, I took too long to get there, and now the dramatic music stopped. Oh, wait, no. No, it's still there. It was just a nice little low beat bit. Hard turn, hard turn. Let's go. And find out if your facts can be trusted. You're full of confidence, right? Let's get to the lumber mill. Oh, it is just magically raising on its own. Good. That's good. Steady wins the race. Whereas gunning it gets you there faster. We made it! Yeah, there was a race flag. I'm going to ignore that. I'm going in alone. 
You two stay no, That means combat. I can't concentrate on profiling with other people around me. Now hold on a minute. We're investigating this case together. Listen, I can't risk the crime scene being compromised by you two. What are you saying? You're not the only professional law enforcement officer here, Agent Morgan. You know how to secure a crime What's wrong with your hand? I'm sorry. That was rude of me. But this is how I operate. Furthermore... Yes? Furthermore what? To me, the outsider FBI agent, every citizen of this town is a suspect. You two could be in on this whole thing for all I know. I have to keep suspects out of the crime scene. How can you say such a thing? Is he making fun of us? <laughs> we should have left him behind and come here by ourselves. You're right. I've never been so insulted. Stand out there in the Sorry, rain. but I'm just doing my job. Nine millimeter handgun, FBI custom. Did you hear that, Zach? If they are pros, then we should let every first person shooter gamer out there join the SWAT team. Oh, snap, he was making fun of chat. Zach, they're here. They're here. Hey, you resemble that remark. Remark, damn it. Oh, hey, more of them. Great. Yes. Sorry, your head's in the way, York. I can't quite see him. She's out of my range. You thought this was a detective game, not Resident Evil? No, it's it's cumbersome story parts broken up by cumbersome combat. And backwards crab walking zombies. And an aiming reticule that's very hard to aim. Bullseye. Bullseye. Amazing, yes. Yeah, get used to a lot of that. Oh. It's the serial killer. Just as I thought, Zack. This is where Anna was killed. Yeah, he really hates cornflakes. Been killing them for years. Profiling start. Ooh, 
Pardon me. Did I scare you, chat? I'm sorry. Yes, yeah, Sora, I sneezed. Part and parcel of having a cold. Parcel, rather. Don't you blacken me. I see you blacken. Thank you, chat. I also didn't have time to warn you because it was already coming before I could say. Don't take that out of context. Too much noise. We're still missing a vital piece of the puzzle. He just put a lit cigarette back in his pack of cigarettes again. It startled your cat and your cat ran away at full speed. Ooh. Zack, it's almost like an altar. Was the murder some kind of ritual? You should have just shouted, you're coming when you feel a sneeze like in anime. You and I watch different animes. Uh, if you mention me mentioning don't take it out of context, then that's technically not out of context, yes. <laughs> Sora's in a nice little ball in her bed, but then the phone ringing in game disturbed her. Sorry, is that the Snatcher from Hat in Time? <laughs> Profiling start. Holy Vice President. This is still going on, huh? Okay, okay. Do I need to shave? Nah, he's fine. Always take another lollipop, though. Key to the engineering section. What does shaving do? Takes away your stubble? I know for a fact Chris B is a guy, I'm surprised smoked salmon in a locker. Surprised they had to ask, he should know that by default. Actually I should have Oh, there's a zombie down there. Should have saved. There's a lot of zombies all of a sudden. Yes, bullseye. Nice shot. Dare you. Amazing. Yeah, they kind of teleport a little bit sometimes.
Deadly Premonition received widely varying critical reviews and holds a Guinness World Record for the most critically polarizing survival horror game. <laughs> it's a very apt um, description. Sorry, I have to make a long distance call. Yeah, hi, FBI. A zombie hit me upside the head. Please send help. Yours sincerely, Francis York Morgan. me using the auto lock on it's making me miss Bullseye. oh you're still alive yes Bullseye, amazing bullseye. I need to clear inventory space so I can pick up the bullets. I thought I already had bullets though. Stop spawning, buddy. Must be running somewhere. Wait, it still says I don't have enough room. I can't stop to read the message because enemies keep spawning unlimitedly. <sighs> Is that it finally? Nope. Amazing. Maybe it's the stairs that's a trigger for them or something? It is a fruitful task. I've got unlimited ammo and I'm gaining ammo for a gun that I just got. I also don't know where I'm supposed to be going. I think it might be a glitch. As in a glitch that's stopping me progressing because I'm constantly spawning. again. I'll probably have to store some of the food. Hey, I was getting good gear off of those things. I didn't have a problem killing them. It's just a shame I apparently don't have any inventory space. Like, is this full here? Oh, I've got 720 on me, and I guess I should probably use some of them, huh? Yep. 
Where is the gun in this list? There it is. Oh, never mind. I need my tool. Thank you, Doozy, for 14 months with Twitch Prime. 14 months well spare. Oh god, it's deadly premonition. Yes. Yes, it is. Isn't that right, Zack? You're all Zack now. Okay, that kills him pretty quick. Zack is your in real life name. <laughs> Excellent. So that means just York is speaking to you personally. Zack. Amazing. Nice shot. I hear a baby. That's in the game, right? There's no baby in the game, you're lying to me. Golf club. I did all that for a golf club? Wait, something else. No, there's not. Doesn't even fit in the locker, correct? Yes. Oh, I think I might have found a clue in the toilet filled with blood. Um. Flushing a toilet, summon the killer? Is that what happened? Nice shot. Amazing. I need any more steel pipes, thanks. I was before. Did I get turned around? I did. Yeah, the killer just went through here. They sometimes say I'm swole. They sometimes tell you to F off. Zombies tell you a lot of things in this game. Said, let me die. <laughs> Up indeed. That one said I'm swole. Oh, nice shot. Uh, 
Teleports behind you. Nothing personnel. a horrid room by the looks of things. Oh, Len. I'm doing okay. Still got a cold to get over, but other than that, totally fine. Okay, can't go that way yet. The gearbox was crying like a baby? me lady. Yes. Great. You okay, can't show me where I can go. Keep dry. <laughs> Wasn't this place submerged in water until I pressed that button earlier? York, stop pushing, buddy. Okay. Brains. Oh no! Pardon me, miss. Bullseye. Great, yes. Why does it look like meat? Ooh. Also, how can I have room for that, but nothing else, like, weapon related? I think this might have been an all-female prison underneath the lumber mill. <laughs> Reach in, yes, no. These are enemy spawn points on the walls. It's a meat toilet. I guess lumber workers had a lot of meat in their diet. start getting hit consistently I'll be able to heal through everything assuming the game pauses if I go to my pause menu. Coffee Black was worth $30 Amazing. in this game's universe, for the record. Bullseye. Nice shot. Amazing. Great. Amazing. Bullseye. Yes. Bullseye. Nice shot. It's so complimentary.
Okay, it needs a thing. Speaking of things, we're going to break there for YouTube. You're welcome. <laughs> 